Okay, no, I don't think right. Should we start from the top or the bottom? And then... <laughs> <laughs> I'm not sure it's going to be that easy. Uh, yeah, but what do the rules say that we're allowed to... That it's just really um, unattractive looking, which I felt added to the story. I didn't really like it, I just gave it a 7 because it actually had an... Yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. They would like it. I mean, I, yeah, I, I did. I thought it was medium. Well, I thought it was medium. Well, I thought it was so, after a few heated debates and agreeing to disagree, the Film North Ants 2015 judges have finally made a decision here at the Movie Hub in Western Favel Shopping Centre. The Judges' Choice Award has been selected, which is top secret, and shortlisters have been posted on the website. Here's what the judges had to say. It was a hard year, actually. Um, I'm saying that they're always hard, it's always really hard because there are loads of films that have different merits and it's deciding which is the merit that we're going to put through. That's the biggest kind of decision, I think. Uh, people have tried different things. I think that's encouraging. Of course, it's also very challenging. It's difficult to do those things and to make them uh, as good as you can and in restricted amount of time, restricted facilities. But I think people have demonstrated that that's possible for today. Judging this year has been actually quite difficult compared to last year where I actually had a clear idea of what my favourite film was. This year the scale of different films has been so varied and different. I've actually wrapped my brains as to what would be in the top five. For the film that won Judge's Choice, I thought that I'd absolutely like When I first clicked play, I was like, I'm going to hate this film, this is going to be terrible. And then it comes to an end and I was like, whoa, it's actually probably the best film. Like structure, like the way it was structured, it was so much better than all the other stuff. Um, so yeah, that was shocking. That's probably the emotion. Like I was shocked watching that. I think when it comes down to it, really, like uh, what makes a good film is a good story. So I think the film that won is probably the best story. It was complete in the way that it was done. And I think we've arrived at this interesting judge's choice, and probably provoked some arguments and discussion and some, uh, a good selection of films. I think they're going to be, um, people are going to be pleasantly surprised. Since we entered, like two years ago, I think over that two years, I think I've seen a lot more brave filmmakers like entering. Like they're just not being like, oh, let me just make this because this is easy. Like this is an easy film to make. They're actually challenging themselves, which is really good to see because I think that's what we've done both times we entered. And um, we tried to push ourselves to like, yeah. where we could go with the money we had, equipment we had and stuff. And yeah, I think I've seen a, uh, like the filmmakers are definitely pushing themselves to different places rather than just staying safe.